happy wednesday or whatever day it is wherever you are and what day you're watching this so hello welcome back to royal appleberry and if today is your first time here hi i'm so glad you have to find my channel happy wednesday and hunter said happy wednesday so, <laughs> so what we are doing today is first off let's say i hope everybody's doing well hope everybody's healthy happy and safe so it's actually sunday but i know i post my videos on wednesday so that's why i said a happy mother cracking wednesday so yeah what we're gonna do another one of my pores that i've just fell madly in love with the colors i'm going to be using is some good old-fashioned titanium dioxide this is td mixed in water which is a natural whitener and then i'm going to be using some good old-fashioned activated charcoal which is black a natural darkener <laughs> or blackener or whatever you want to say and then and then i'm going to be using mad micas which used to be mad oils i'm going to use their voodoo that you do so well and that is that color i've done this color palette a long time ago so i was like you know what girl it's time to bring it back now the fun part is what's in here it's gonna be essential oil blend i'm just digging essential oils I told you guys that like we're dating and like things are getting really serious between us <laughs> i'm not gonna break up yes i'm a cheater i'm not gonna break up with my fragrance oils they know that you know i'm kind of loosey-goosey like that but <laughs> they're slowly coming to terms that they're gonna have to share me with essential oils i know that sounds very sordid but hey so um what i am going to be doing is separating off these couleurs and I'll add what I need. I don't need to put any for the white because it's already mixed in water. So I can just go ahead and pour that into this cup. I think I'll use about that much for starters. And then, see? <sighs> yeah, um, I'm not, as of right now, today is March 23rd. I am not on, um, I guess, lockdown, shutdown, whatever you want to call it, a quarantine by the government. Um, I'm just waiting here. So, in the meantime, in between time, I'm making soap. Don't know when this video will be posted. I pray to God first, I want to say, and I don't know what you believe in and if you pray or not, but I'm going to pray for you anyway because I love y'all. So, I pray that God keeps all of us safe, you know, um, and healthy. And uh, whatever you believe in, just send out those good vibes for all of us so that we can uh, continue to be healthy and safe in these crazy times. So, now with that being said, because I love y'all and I want to see each and one, every one of you back here after all this blows over. So, we're going to go ahead and put this pink in here. Ooh, that's a pretty, pretty, pretty pink. I like it. Mama like. I put just a hair bit more because I kind of want it dark. Then, I normally don't talk in the beginning of these videos, but I just felt like I wanted to talk to y'all first. Tell y'all what I'm doing. I love, oh, I didn't even tell you what's in this blend. Durr. Okay, what's in this essential blend oil? I have some, and you guys know, if you know me, you know I'm allergic, allergic, not allergic, allergic to orange. So I'm not touching this. I'm being very careful. Um, it's lavender, orange, lemon, and bergamot. That is the blend of essential oils that I'm using. So, go ahead and make that nice and inky. Alright. I'm going to go ahead and get all this mixed in and we're going to start. I'm going to grab my angler. You're going to see my angler in this video if you're new, if you're not. A lot of people ask me where I get it from. The link to the store is in the description box below. I didn't give a link to the exact... Um, um, product the angler you can easily find it just look through there i want you guys to look through their shot because you just might come across something that you didn't know you needed there you go so um enjoy the music
Okie dokie. So, I let this one, I just wanted to test. Test it out and see what would happen. But I left this one sitting on an angle so I can thicken up on an angle. And as you can see, it's still on an angle. Now, I am going to give it a little bit of a shoogly. Yeah, to get it back down. Just because I don't think I wanted it to stay on an angle on the top. But I just wanted some of those layers on the bottom. If that makes any sense what I'm saying. Some of those layers on the bottom to stay. You know, not go straight. That's what I'm trying to say. So I'm going to take this skewer. And just pull that down. And I do love the way this top looks. It looks almost like graffiti. So, with that being said. I'm going to leave it. I'm not going to do a mantra or anything. I'm going to leave it just like that because I think that is cool, man. So, I think you guys can see. I'm too short. I lift my camera up, but now I can't see. <laughs> but yeah, okay. And one more thing I'm going to do, which I had intended to do from the very beginning. Gold will almost really wake that up. I kind of feel like it would. Mmm, guys. There's no gold in this soap anywhere, but I'm going to do it. I was going to do pink. But I want to do go, and I'm gonna I'm gonna do it. Yes, I'm gonna do it. So I'm just popping some of those air bubbles. There we go. That is so cool. I love it. But yeah, I'm popping some of those air bubbles. I don't want a lot. I just kind of want to do some of that. Okay, <laughs> I think one more. There we go. That's what I wanted to do. I didn't want to go crazy. I think this is cool. I put one more. Oops, in the mold. There we go. Okay, yeah, because you're not know, gonna be extra. So there we go. Oh my, that's lovely. I love it. 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 That is gorgeous. I wasn't expecting to do that, but I did it, and I'm happy that I did. So I'm gonna go ahead and clean these sides up. Yes, I am. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I am going to put this one to bed, as in um, gel it, because I would like for these colors to really pop. Does that really happen? I don't know. I just, I like to gel my soaps. It's said that if you gel your soaps, your colors are more vibrant. But I like to gel my soaps because it makes it easier to get them out the mold sooner too. Um, have I experienced the colors being a lot more vibrant? I can't really say I'm sure of that. But yeah. So yeah, if you like this soap so far, please be sure to give a thumbs up. I'm going to give you guys a close up. I'm not going to pick it up because she is quite jiggly. But um, yeah, she looks kind of galaxy like but she is gold juice i just love the way this soap looks i really really do and i hope you guys do too so like i said if you do give a thumbs up this side is so cool i can't tilt it and let you guys see it but you can stick around because cutting is coming up right now hi friends welcome back to the cut of this soap so look at that side isn't it just stellar i kind of i gotta remember if i had a soap called stellar i don't think so but this one is going to be called stellar it's just so stellar that's the other side but here's the top guys 
now you see why I want to name it Stellar. Oh my gosh. I wanted to name it Galaxy or Galactic or something like that because that's what it looks like to me. But, um, yeah, I think this is going to be called Stellar. It's so pretty. And it's been sitting for about a week. And oh, just look at those uh, mica drizzles, how it's sunken in. I love that. The very first person I saw do this shout out time was my darling Clyde Yoshida over at Vibrant Soap. Um, I just think it looks so cool. So, yeah, I've been really wanting to cut this off. I was just like, ooh, boo, just hold on, let it hang out for a little bit. So, I showed some patience. Um, happy Wednesday. First, let's say that. And let's turn on this music. But, um, yeah, happy Wednesday. It's actually Friday. <laughs> but I post my videos on Wednesday. So, happy Wednesday to you or whatever day it is where you are. Um... Yeah, I'm talking in this video like this is my first time filming. <laughs> but I'm so excited. So let's see what's on the inside of this soap. Oh, wow. Wow. Um, okay. <laughs> this does not look like the pour that I did at all. But that is so interesting. Now, I left, if you guys remember, I left that one on a tilt a little bit. So I just wanted to see what kind of swirls I would get. So I'm hoping, I'm not going to lie, I'm hoping it's better than what that is. Oh yes, okay, so this is a lot better. That is so, I'm just, you know what, let me grab my other piece. I want you guys to see something. Okay, this is what I like so much about this pour. You just kind of never know what you're going to get, you really don't. So, there's this one, and that one this one now this one like you just can't really determine and they're all done with the same exact pour you just can't really determine what you're going to get so that is so interesting that is very interesting indeed i was not expecting that honestly i was expecting more of more of this one interesting i like it though <laughs> i really do like it i'm just kind of shocked because I thought I knew what I was going to get. So that's why it's always a surprise for me to cut these soaps. Uh, and it smells so good. Now, right now, it smells of lavender and orange. But there's like a underlying, like, soft powdery or musky note. I know those are two different notes. But it's kind of hard for me to explain. But it's really, really good. And I like that it's... Okay, like for reals, I'm getting annoyed with this camera. <laughs> so I think it was my battery. I don't, it's odd because I didn't, I didn't uh, film that much where I needed to change my battery. But anywho, so let's try this again. I said the top of this looks like it should be Galaxy. I'll come up with a name. By the time you see this video and this soap is in my shop, it will have a name. But I was talking about, I don't even know if the camera showed that. I'm quickly going over what I said because it's so annoying. I was saying how surprisingly different that all of these uh, patterns are, although I did the same swirl on all three of them, all four of them, <laughs> but they're so different. So I was really expecting it to look like this and somewhat like this, but I really wasn't expecting that and I'm not mad at it. So, okay, let me look and make sure we're still recording. So, <laughs> um, matter of fact, let me really make sure we're still recording. Ooh, short people you know what I mean okay we are recording so whew. anywho I love this soap it smells really good I don't know what I said well I don't know what was recorded I said that it smells like lavender and orange with an underlying note of something powdery or musky it smells really really lovely it does so I'm going to go ahead and get this chopped up before the camera decides to go off again. But I'm still just can't. I can't even really get over this swirl. My gosh, it is so different. So very different. You guys like this? If you do, let me know in the comment section. Say yes, I like it. Or, hmm, that's different. So, <laughs> um, this is definitely in the shop right now. Um, for those of you who are new and you don't understand how this soap is in the shop right now without a cure time. I film my videos normally a month in advance. Sometimes it's longer than that. It just depends on how many videos I have to crank out. So by the time you guys see these videos, the soaps are fully cured. And I do it that way on purpose. So you don't have to wait. Because if I was, say, to cut this today and film it today, 
I mean, uh, yeah, enlisted today, then you have to wait four to six weeks of a cure time. And I don't want my customers to wait because I don't like waiting as a consumer. So yeah. Yeah, so just wanted to pop in here and give you guys a little bit of happiness hopefully this makes you happy this is a weird looking soap man but it's so cool looking when they sit together so hmm I just don't know I like it though I really do like it I really really do like it but it is so unusual looking to anything I've ever done so I'm excited to do another pour right now I've been thinking about how I really want to do a really cool looking soap I kind of have it in mind it's gonna take a lot of work but we'll see how I feel Gabe is normally one to master batch for me but Gabe and Hunter is working from home so no time for hanging out down here doing things for Kenny they have to work so um yep yeah, and that's just the oh that's an inch exactly so there you go but yeah I'm gonna master batch and then I'll make some soap but these are so cool. So I'm going to give you guys a little bit of a sneak peek of, not sneak peek, you just saw it. Give you a look at how they look together. So I'll put a few more. But aren't those cool? Like they are so unusual. Wow. I'm just kind of seriously blown away. I know I keep saying it, guys, but I really am blown away. Like, compared to this, this, and this. That is so different. All right. Anyway, enough about that talk. Love, hugs, and kisses. Be awesome in everything, everything you do. Wash your hands. Stay away from each other. Love each other from a distance. <laughs> Be kind to one another. And help each other if you have seniors in your neighborhood and you don't really know them. Get to know them and see if they need anything. Any way you can help out, we all have the opportunity to help one another and I'll see you guys in the next making video bye love y'all